Anybody here from Zetamore? Uh, guys, I'm right outside. And so is something else. Gosh, we've missed you, partner. Glad you could make it. But first, how was Aida? Well, we had to make do with uh, this new specimen here. I've been trying to get here for over four hours, Peter. Traffic is a little blocked right now. Wait. I know that thud. Winston, what do you see out there? It's big. It's clean and soft and white. And you all aren't gonna like it. No, this is not possible. Not here, not now. Not again! I swear it. Times Square, post-urban renewal. All shiny and clean. I love it. Say, is that him? It's hard to miss. Egon, how close do we have to get the big trap to reel him in? A lot closer than this. Let's see if you can. He's looking for something. Is he looking for something or someone? All full, going up. Uh, he, uh, just passed gas. Catch the next one. Relax, sir. We handle foul vapors all the time. Let's stay in for lunch, you said. Why leave the building, you said. It'll be quiet, you said. You know you're fired. You're right. I secretly knew our lives would be in danger and thought, Hey, I'll make sure I trap Mark with me inside an elevator! Excuse us. Stay with me, Haas. I'm sure there's more fun up ahead. Oh, I missed him. Could be trouble. Sudden movements. Okay, it sure got quiet all of a sudden. They're in the pit! They're in the pit! Don't let them circle behind you! Ah, I'm covered in marshmallow minion goo! 
J-Pop is working overtime, generating new industry. Egon and I were talking about creating minions to get more work done in the lab. Maybe they could be domesticated, like Slimer. Good shooting. Ah! Night and shining proton pack time. Oh, man. Beckman, come in, please. Pandemonium up here. Chunks of the building missing everywhere. You are required at the site now. So happy to be in demand, but these sugar balls have got me nailed down. I can't get past them. They're disgusting. And they're unhealthy. Ah, uh, did I mention there's a spectacularly beautiful lady in distress? I'll be right there. Ah! Showtime. No! Somebody help me! Easy now, miss. Just relax. No sudden movements. Perfectly safe now. Sudden movement! Sudden movement! Check it out, kid. What a view, huh? Manhattan. I love it. Uh, well, you're just lucky to have met someone as special as me, okay? It's okay. Dr. Frank Mahasher, you're fine now. You didn't spill your coffee, did you, Peter? Ray, I got coffee for all of us. But the little monster spilled it. And what's the story with those things, anyway? What? Was that a manifestation of Gozer? Uh, yeah, probably. It just may be. Could be. Would you like to take the most direct route out of here, or the scenic route to its lady's choice? There's a stairwell over here. Let's go. Ooh. Yao, Grace under pressure. I appreciate that, in a lady. Okay, Slugger, let's you and me do this quick and quiet, before Tubby Soft Squeeze out there figures out what we're up to. I think Tubby Soft Squeeze has dog ears, Ray. We're not getting out of here that way. Well, it was a good plan for a second. Okay. Let's think. What did people do before stairs? Was it ladders or just jumping from rock to rock? We go up then, to the roof. Well, that's some relief. Come on, let's go.
That was cow there. Cool your heels in there for a while. signal. for everybody from 54th Street to 5th Avenue. Happy Thanksgiving! There he goes! The big evil sailor all the way to the... Oh! Not quite. Didn't make it. Hey, Ray, say three guys the size of your finger knocked you off the side of a 30-story building and you had to climb all the way back up to tear them apart. How, how mad would you be at those three little dinky types? I'd go with Mighty Pissed. Uh -huh. Okay, and throw in a sugar high, too. That giant blue and white toy man thing, or whatever, is still coming. It's climbing the building. I'm impressed with his agility, considering his complete lack of bones. Good news. We've got the Super Slammer back on pulse and Ecto-1 is rolling. We're repositioning now. Can you hold the Stay Puff there for a few minutes? If by few you mean less than one, then sure, we can do that. Hey, did somebody tell you it was break time? No sweat, kid. We've got you. Well, as long as you're down there, would you see if you could knock off Mr. Sweetness? All right there, sunshine. Are you okay? You're all strapped in. We've got a good tight grip on your belt. Here he comes! The Big Daddy Manifestation himself! A raging blob of densely packed marshmallow! Oh boy! Melt him, Chief! Give him full screen! He's right, Rookie. Your health insurance doesn't begin for another 89 days. More of those minis. How many can he generate? From 200,000 square feet of solid marshmallow? Probably 60. Darts! 
You've killed my dessert! Scoreboard reads Ghostbusters 2, Gozer the Gozerian 0. Looking like a real big leaguer out there, champ. Ray, Peter, we're in position. The trap is set. We're prepared to capture Stay Puff. Where is he? He's that white puddle you're driving through? Timing's off by just a hair, Egon, but we're glad the trap is working again. I guess I owe you guys my life. She's clean. How do you feel? Pretty good. All extremely weird things considered. So far, just another screwed up day at the office. You know, I never forget a face attached to all the rest of that. I think we met earlier at the Sedgwick Hotel. You gave me the sideshow chicken drop. My name's Alyssa, Dr. Alyssa Selwyn, and- I am Dr. Peter Venkman, and that's uh, Egon. It's uh, Ray, Winston, and uh, you met him. Uh-huh, the Ghostbusters. Have you ever been involved in this type of quantum temporal rift event before? A quantum what? It's called arcing, a large pulse of psychic energy. Actually, yes. I was at the museum. A pulse of blue light surged through the building, and then I was standing outside a room on the 13th floor of an old hotel. The Sedgwick. The Sedgwick doesn't have a 13th floor. It was pulling me like a magnet. I felt as though I was in a deep dream. I came to and ran over here. Here? It's a temporary office while I'm in town. I came to do some research after I woke up. We'd like you to come to our lab so we can run some brief tests and ask you more questions. Here's an easy one. Would you like to go out for Thai, Mexican, Japanese? Wow, Dr. Venkman. That time you almost went 45 seconds without saying something abrasive. Want to try for a whole minute next time? A doctor, and a fiery one, too. Charming. So charming. <laughs>